Hello and welcome to a TV show trailer reaction this time around. Um, Fallout, the teaser trailer's out, and I've enjoyed most of the shows that I've watched on Prime so far. Um, Wheel of Time is great. Um, there seems to be a new love for adaptations lately, and I'm down for it. I've never really played Fallout, so I would be going this into this as a gamer, but not a Fallout fan, because I've never really played them at all. Um, but the idea of them seems like it could be interesting. Um, this, like if, if done right, I think this could be a good show. So let's take a look at the teaser and see if we can judge what we think about it, eh? I know that I've lived a relatively comfortable life. Dwellers are an endangered species. I do not think you would be willing to do what it takes to survive up here. We'll watch it through and then we'll go back. If you insist on staying, then you will have to adapt. Alright. A bright new sun will suddenly break through. But I don't want to see tomorrow. No notes. Unless I see it with you. I grabbed the moldy one. <clears throat> Yeah. I mean, this looks surprisingly good. April 12th, huh? All right. So, I mean, it's one of those shows. Like, look, visual looks like they've nailed the aesthetic. So, I mean, I've seen enough Fallout to know the aesthetic. They nailed it. Um, as for, like, how it's how well it portrays Fallout, I have no idea. Um, the accent seems good. The, uh, like, set dressing, amazing. Love this, this little moment where the tubbleweed goes by. She's, like, scared of it. Uh, that was funny. It looks like it's a nice combination of like gruesome and and you know almost horror-y and wa uh, warlike with like the like the monster, the bear scene here at the end, and the like this thing. Ugh. This ugh. like they've nailed the combination of that intense moments with like dog, um, funny moments like this. Yeah, they they seems and then you know the classic Fallout suits as well, the Brother of the Seal. Yeah, I know, I know, I know a bit of lore. Um, no, but so yeah, like it feels to me like they have very much nailed the um, the vibe of Fallout. As if that vibe will work on the TV screen, if the story and the acting and the writing of the show is good enough, that remains to be seen, of course. But the vibe seems to be caught, and that is step number one, the, arguably the most important step. Um, at least when you're adapting something. So yeah, I feel like they've, they've nailed the vibe, and I'm kind of excited to see it now. Um, maybe I can either get my watch, wife to watch it with me, or I'll watch it maybe with you guys. Uh, we'll see. April's far away out. We have plenty of time to, to make up our mind about that one. Uh, but yeah. Looks good.
on Prime Video. Um, good thing. Uh, Prime is seemingly doing, like, they have a bunch of shows now that I really, really enjoy. Like, they have Wheel of Time, Legend of Vox Machina. I enjoyed R Rings of Power, even though it had its issues. Um, I mean, so far, it's, like, the show makes it, se it seems like uh, it's keeping it relevant for me. Yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.